Off to a great start here. For San Francisco, and they were spurred on by a strong performance in that fourth quarter. This offensive line just didn't stand a chance this week. All right, we'll go speed rusher for Sam Hubbard. The rest of these I'll just automate. All right, so now let's take a minute to see how you can improve your Preston team. Brown. Jeez. The injuries are stacking up for us. Ooh. For Malik Jefferson. Hold the Bills to less than 250 total yards or get Malik Jefferson an interception force... One plus... Interception force fumbles, TFLs, and sacks. So we got to play defense this week then. Quick reminder to download and like my Here's draft class. We've got about 20 players draft. in there now, so like 15 I think it was. Player and unlock his best skill. Each skill unlock will cost you scouting points. Unlock this player's true skill ranking to see if he is a You just found a diamond in the rough. So I think what we're going to do here is play defense and only user team. Malik Jefferson. And we're going to use the... Uh, see, this new, this new um, scenario engine gives us the opportunity to do kind of more specific storylines like this. So Malik Jefferson's kind of starting to break out. He had a good week last week apparently let's let's see what he did we we got an injury so he's gonna start this week i did add grant delpert delpit thing um so malik jefferson i guess i went for his total season but yeah he's got eight tackles a sack and a half and then we've got two linebackers out so he's kind of filling that void which is cool i i don't think that has anything to do with him getting the breakout player prompt but we are going to go ahead and make him the starting middle linebacker here. And we'll start uh, Evans over there. Because I'm assuming that Vigil's left. Yeah. So we'll go with this. And we'll see what, uh, what we can get here. And he had an upgrade last week. So we're going to hold on to this. If he gets star, he'll he'll develop faster. So this is an interesting narrative here. Malik Jefferson week. I'm not a big Malik Jefferson fan, but at least someone's getting this, uh, this love. It's just cool to see that. It's a narrative type of thing that we've just never really had with Madden franchise mode. All right, here we go. So we're gonna do. We are in the first quarter. We get you back to the action. To see how this defense can do on this upcoming drive. So we. Oh, he's not in there as our. Off to a great start. He's not in there as our sub linebacker right now. Uh, where is he? Way down there. <laughs> this cover skills leave a little bit to be desired. That's for sure. All right. Let's use Fejadelm for this one. So they fake the handoff. Now Allen. They'll get this one complete to Zay Jones. And they'll get it all the way up about five yards shy of midfield. Just like that, a pickup of 20 on their first play for Did he scrimmage. say that they're working on anything, Nick, for the I know many people thing? like to throw to the tight end, maybe in a little flexed out position because he creates mismatches right, with see, his size. The slot receivers do the same thing with their quickness, their speed, and their route running savvy. He's able to get this to the 40-yard line before he's out of bounds. Another good game. Hey, 58 That's isn't all that bad anymore. <laughs> 
watching the wide receiver screen because it's a real teamwork play. Because guess what? The guy catching the ball, he'll get all the credit. But how about the people up to block in front of him? Either fellow receivers. There's a tackle. Linemen. That makes that play a really nice timing play. And sometimes it can break big. The numbers for him from a week ago. I wish I could just turn on like auto play calls so I can just focus on this. Good consistent performances each and every week. You will rank in the top ten in the league in receiving yards, and he's number seven currently, hoping to move up as time goes on. Here's Allen on first and ten. Jones has it. A gain of six there on first. I'm just gonna go with the A call for most of these. Oh jeez. Really in the slot. Wait, we're on vigil. That's not good. Jeez, we bit hard on that play action. How about the start throwing the football? Four for four on this opening drive. Oh, he's slinging it. And oftentimes when you talk about slinging it, you're thinking about a guy throwing it all over the yard, not necessarily accurately. In this case, though, he's honing in on his targets, and he's delivering. Yeah, the opening script, however, they drew it up for this This is always drive. interesting, trying to play so the defensive it's view. It's a loss of five there, bringing up second. Oh, it's tired right there. He ran right into the teeth of the blitz as the linebacker was freeing up in order to stop that one for a loss. I'll start. I think yeah, baby, bring him back. Got to find a way to audible into something a little more advantageous. That's going to set him back five yards. Things made a little more difficult after the false start as they try again on second and goal. Play action. Yep, now play action. Off the bootleg. Oh, sack. Let's go, Gino. That's so just Josh Allen. Just trying to do too much. Takes a huge sack. Two sacks last week. Another one right here. He's we got the mid read. Lately, and I think that goes all the way back to not just his offseason, but the film study he's been doing during the week. Because I think he's found matchups that he likes, and he's capitalizing. And a few times he's even defeated double teams. He doesn't care at this point. All right. Give him six Hold him to a field goal. And it'll be fourth down. I guess we'll just play it. It might be faster. Who knows? So off goes Allen, and on comes Steven Hauschka for the Buffalo field goal. Right hash, 37-yard attempt. And the 11 year veteran yeah, pretty much dogger. <laughs> Million-dollar athlete, five-cent instincts. Yeah, that's about. Sounds about Malik Jefferson. Early on in the game, first quarter. Let's see how this defense does on this drive. Here's the Buffalo offense now as they get set to take over here. And after the field goal last time, we'll see what they can get here. At least they got points out of the last drive, Charles. I've never met an offensive coach that didn't Doing our own thing out here. We're, we're doing our best Zach Brown impression. Thanks for the... Way better than Thanks for the cheer, Woofy. Which is a punt. Yeah, but you've met fan bases that wanted that. <laughs> you like this view, Nick? <laughs> Not to mix this into my all my rebuilds. It's this kind of narrative stuff. I like it. Point. That's it. A good pick it's up just different. You know, fixes it up. Yards. On first down, Allen. Oh God. We and lift. I knew that's where the ball was going too. I just. He's gonna get a solid gain of nine. It's hard to kind of play it. Partners, a lot of fun watching the NFL now, isn't it? Be because run. when the big fella runs routes, it used to be when we were kids, he'd run about three different routes, and that was it. We are struggling out here. Anything, this doesn't exactly look like a breakout game, game, but maybe we can turn it around. The goal for any offense versus his own defense, find the holes where guys are available and put the ball on the receiver before any defender can step up and fill it. They did it well there. Perfectly executed crossing route. He's going with the A call for all these receivers, especially the little guys that we're watching here, are just quicker than fast. A lot of them combine quickness and speed, and they catch a lot of footballs as we just saw there. Allen's throw is complete, and inside the twenty before he's Josh Allen nine for nine. He's exceeded receiving yards from a week ago, and we're still in the first half. Hey, he's made improvements, guys. Don't be mean to Josh Allen. Oh, that's a flag. He stepped out. For the moment, 
it's a touchdown, but multiple flags down, so let's sort this out. So erase the red zone score. They'll have to dial that one up again. And you know how difficult it is Ron, to strike in the red zone because things are a little bit more condensed. You gotta go back to their play chart and see if they can dial up another one. Oh, reach your hands out, Jefferson. God, we are miserable right now. Gus Edwards. His... So a first and ten coming up for the offense here in the second quarter. Okay, we're going to play Let's just one possession from the, our normal angle. Throwing on first down is Allen. On the left side, he finds Beasley. Five yards on the catch there brings up second down. So a look here at the key inactives, and we got this list before the game down on the field. And they tell us the same thing every time, don't they? Next man up. No excuses. Be ready oh, man. That's the mantra of every organization. We actually almost had it that time. Having guys on the roster who are capable of filling in and playing at a high level, that's when you know you've drafted well, scouted free agents well, and stocked your team just the way you're supposed to. Oh, no. Now McCoy. And he'll be taken down, but not before he gets in the enemy territory. Offense not doing us any favors. Yeah, that's that's probably to be expected with the Bengals. First down. I remember a coaching friend of mine used to tell his running backs before games, make sure you run and jog with your offensive line in pregame. Get used to the ground shaking when those big behemoths start to create space for you up front. He did a pretty good job. There's Jefferson getting a tackle. For a nice explosive run. A big play on the catch and run covering 34 yards. Well, one thing's for sure. They're going to have to come up with something at halftime because he is absolutely roasting them right now. They're going to go through the whole litany of things, changing coverages, you know, what are we going to do? What All right, come on. We need that big play with Jefferson. Treat it like a good pitcher treats pitching a game. Change your timing. Change your location. So sometimes you're up on him, sometimes you're back. Just change up the looks that he sees and make him just a little bit more hesitant. The second down attempt there, knocked down as it leaves the quarterback's hand, and it's incomplete. All right, third down. That is the first time that they've targeted him that he has not come down with a catch. He's caught everything that's been thrown his way, a dominant pass receiver that can break down any defense Ooh, because he's doing that. that kind of work. It really hurts you on the back end. And even though it's an incompletion there, I think Corey Grant to the work. Packers. That's More problems here on third down. He can, can play. Only once so far in this first Ooh, half. Buffalo's you challenging. Uh -oh. I do in this league. If you don't win on third down, it makes it hard. All right, they upheld it. That gives them some explosiveness at running back behind Aaron Jones. It also gives them a freaking kick return. Just something they need. A reminder coming up Wait, later. We aren't playing we offense. What are we doing? Right, we get one play. Rounds. They've been doing some travel. Back to back prime time games for them. Monday night they were in New and we York. Get set. Now the, and the Bills are going to get him as he goes down. The veteran Jerry Hughes drops the hammer in the backfield. Our offense is so bad. I don't know why we ended up playing on. I don't know what changed and why I can't. I guess I gotta go super soon. It doesn't really matter. Sometimes it's just a great play made by the defense. Big time sack. Dolby gives to Bernard. And he'll lose yardage here. Back to the 15. All right. That'll be I don't know what changed there, but all right. I guess we simmed the PAT, didn't we? All right, Jefferson. Let's make a play. The offensive line is definitely why we can't score. Here's the Buffalo offense now as they get set to take over here. Now a play fake here on first down. Oh, we almost got a strip. That's what we need is a forced fumble. So much goes into a successful play, doesn't it? How about that play action there? Freezing the defense just enough. Spring the tight end free downfield for the completion. All right. And he will lose yardage here to the 31-yard line. A second down play results in a loss of two yards. And we've hit the two-minute mark in this first half of action. Throwing his helmet on third. It's caught. Jones. And he slips up past the 45 before being tackled. God. It's a pick Allen's just dissecting us. 
That was a pretty good throw on the curl route there. Third down, and they pick up the first. Defense should be aware for that. Go the wrong way. They should be aware, but it's so hard to yeah, It's not easy. Because <laughs> when, they, when they sell that route really well, you think they're going All right, we need a pick. We need a sack. We need a TFL. And complete the play. To throw again on second down. Allen looking left. I'm pretty sure we just need one of them. That's McCoy. And we gain a we gain a depth boost for Malik seven. Jefferson. Nine yards to pick up there, and it's a first down. From normal to star. Not only did we just see back-to-back -back nice gains, but we're also seeing the confidence rise, not just for the guy who caught it, but the guy throwing it as well. And these Man. can these back-to-back -back catches. Josh the Allen. Field, that can set something up downfield in a later sequence, right? A lot of the time, it starts to draw the defense closer to the line of scrimmage. So to your point, show this swing pass, show this check down. Maybe later on, we heave one deep when you catch him close to the spot. Oh, that was that was a nice animation. On first down, but it winds up incomplete. The Alabama man, Dre Kirkpatrick, there on the coverage. Cook hands that time to knock that one away. It sure looked like a short touchdown, but able to get a good break uh, on the football and force the incompletion. Jeez. I jumped it too. I just couldn't quite react fast enough. Drive third quarter, and we'll see how this defense comes out of the locker room. Allen now on first down. Oh, there's that man again. It's complete, and he's upended at the 33. Following a good Wait, why is, are they suggesting goal line? I guess they are. They like going to him in the slot. He catches another one. I think this comes under the heading of until they stop him. Why not go back to it? He has something going really well. Great working relationship with the guy. Oh, we almost got that sack. Oh, that was just a straight up drop. We're coming so close to getting what we need. We're coming close to picks. to the second half. I think it's a little bit of a surprise to me, but that was one he should have caught. Absolutely. That was his best opportunity right there. He dropped it. They'll try and run for it with McCoy. And he's got the first down yardage before he's brought down at the 42. It's a nine-yard gain, and it keeps the drive moving. On third down, that's a good job of situational football and understanding where the first down marker was and getting there. And they'll keep it on the ground with McCall. Wow, Malik Jefferson, he's not good. To the 48. This is much harder to get a TFL than I thought it would be. Second and four. Third quarter, and you've got the lead. You're not ready to go into that four-minute offense to close the game out, but a running game can really benefit your team right now. And he'll get it down to the 47 That's all right, Brandon. Here. Glad you made it. A gain it. of five, good enough for the first down. They're trying to show that they can run the ball, protect this lead, give it to the backs, put a little bit of keep away, don't you think? And that's probably a good philosophy at this point. God, he can't even hit that tackle. And he's tackled a yard short of the marker. Good all right, Darth. I'm going to prove you wrong. we still got plenty of time to get this depth rate. Watch this TFL on this play right here. staying ahead of the chains. Really good pickup on first down, hitting the tight end there. Now brings up a second and At least I got the tackle. That was a Blake Martinez tackle, though, after a 20 yard game. Getting this one all the way down inside the 20. Looks to me like maybe there's a little attrition setting in with this. I job. am loving Matt the 20, Brandon. Run, I get the feeling the defense getting a little bit tired. And that's the last thing they need, especially when they look up at the scoreboard. Now he's going to swing this one out to his running back. Back-to-back -back tackles, baby. And he's brought down. A nice little juke move that preceded it, but not much thereafter. Second and five after the five-yard completion on first down. To throw, it's Allen. Oh, man, the throwback. And this is caught for Jeez. touchdown. Patrick DeMarco. That was probably our guy, too. His first touchdown Jeez. here of the new camp. Offense is just miserable too. Ten coming up for the offense. We'll see how this defense does here in the third quarter. Now a first down carry here for McCoy, and this will be a gain of six when it's all said and done. Down to the 15 from the 21. Come on. Frustrating for a defense, energizing for an offense. Finding a way to create that type of yardage in your running game. Oh, is that a TFL? I don't think it was. God, it was close, though. And despite the fancy footwork we saw, they'll get to him just inside the 15. 
the goal of a wide receiver screen is get enough blockers in front to create a wall and let him pick his spot to run the football. I got the defense there swarming to it and not allowing that to happen. Did not let him get downfield. Give him a gain of four. All right, I'm feeling convert, it this time. And that sets up first and goal now. So it's pretty simple, partner. You pick up a turnover, set you up in excellent field position. The last thing you want to do is go three and out in this spot. Taylor would have to settle for a field goal attempt, but now they keep those touchdown hopes alive. Encroachment, defense. Oh, yeah, I, I feel like the Bengals would have a decent so chance of getting blown out in Buffalo. Away. And it's a killer. Bengals are not going to travel well this year. Don't move across the line of scrimmage until the ball Not without moves. their tackle. Now looks to throw. Now he's got it. But he'll be brought down somewhat awkwardly here. And a late flag as well. I think this one's going to be a face mask. Face mask. Given the yardage on the pass, yes, this is the 10-hour trial. Because they're inside the 30. So All right, Jefferson, make a play. Full 15, right? You have half the distance to the goal. In any event, that's precious real estate given up. From the gun, it's All right. And his throw here is incomplete. Tyler Croft, the tight end, the one he was looking for. But it'll be second and <clears> goal. <throat> Down this close to the goal line, first down. Surprised that wasn't a run. I am, and you know I'm old school. I'm oh, Dunlap blew our TFL. We were actually there for that one. That gives me an option of running play action, maybe throwing it. All right, this is where we get our pick. And that's going to bring up an interesting third and goal. I'm telling you guys, it's His coming. path became similar to almost running a stretch play, didn't it? Trying to find a crease anywhere to put his foot in the ground and cut back. It's just never Good play by Vigil. Now a third down throw, but it misses the target incomplete. You hear the calls for Clock's penalty, ticking for Willie so. Jefferson to get that development trait. The defender is making sure his guy couldn't hold on to the football. So I don't see anything to warrant to the flag. No, I'm with you. There was contact, but I'm happy they kept What glitch the are you referring to? So I have um, I have another gamer tag with the EA access, so I feel like I'll probably have plenty of time. So we're in the third quarter. We'll see how this defense handles the upcoming drive as the offense takes over with a first and ten. Here's the Buffalo offense now as they get set to take over here. And now you've got the clock winding down here in the third quarter. Your three scores to the good. Oh, what your approach that was a good play. He's definitely looking better once we switch this camera angle. Yet at the same time, you're also not going pell-mell like you would in two-minute offense. This is what NFL offenses call four-minute football. Take the clock out of the game a little bit, wind it down, but at the same time, keep advancing the ball down the field. Back now in Buffalo. A lot of happy faces in the crowd at this point as their guys have a big lead here to start quarter number four. Oh, man. Down now. It's McCoy. And they'll get we got in the backfield, but he cut inside. Three. Seven yards there and a first down. Uh, he's still rumbling, isn't he? Still looking for Yeah, but we had injuries, so it's... A big reason why we had to start well Jefferson anyway. And he did tell us that he thrives on being at his peak late in ball games. No gain there on the completion, second and ten. Well, that was a simple throw and catch, but even with that completion, no, I'll be using this gamer tag from now on. Behind schedule, I'm down in distance. I think they were hoping to get it to him. He could make a man or two miss, but that no way were his feet in there. Are you nice serious? Here, right side, he holds it in. That one covers 24 yards. It's a first. Can I challenge that? Let's see this. I feel like sidelines are definitely still broken. There's no way that's a freaking catch. His, his, all his feet are out of bounds. It's going to be upheld because this game has no idea. It never has. Sidelines are just so dumb. Oh, they overturned it. A working challenge. Sure wow. Coach, when you throw the flag, you I don't know if that was lucky or if that's a thing now for this game. You were right, a sigh of relief. Not only a sigh of relief, a little vindication as well. Oh my gosh, really? I was prepared to catch it off of a, like... A first down and then Jeez. I was just thinking that was going to get swatted and then I could... Alright, this is a run, come on. Coverage has been a problem all game long. And I would say that going along with that has been confidence. Because even if they had the right cut, they've still dented them. 
And now it's been a real issue. For Zay Jones is just out here. Two it's on a loss one. of a yard there, and it's second down. Brandon, it's clearly a running situation when you're up in the fourth quarter. They're going to have to stack the box and make it difficult for them to move the ball. Made it very difficult right there. Now they need to repeat that. Jeez. Yeah, bring seven, eight, nine, whatever it's going to take to slow them down. Uh, I like that receivers don't drop the ball just the second they sniff someone. Nice it does see, feel like maybe catching needs to be turned on just a little bit. Maybe. And I know I don't my know. background says, why do you need to do this? Just go ahead and run out the clock and get a win. But as many people pointed out to me, it's a video game, man. Go ahead and put the numbers up. Sportsmanship, not an issue. Exercise those fingers. Bottom line, they want to keep this clock rolling, so they'll take that one right there. They just want to keep falling forward, and they won't put the onus on the big fellows up front in order to bring this one home. And he'll be dropped at the Come on, we need that TFL or that pick, Jefferson. They're a pretty good spot right now with a convincing lead. I think this is where they put on the boxing gloves, start to try to pound them into submission. And the offensive line. Oh, we were right there. Oh, man. And oh, he's just going to be short. That was such a good play. Maybe by a half a foot. Has it been the best performance by this defense? They've been picked apart all game long, so they'll hope to at least finish strong in the fourth quarter. We were right there. Gosh, how close have we come in the second half to getting him what he needs? And when do they start thinking about burning these timeouts? They've got all three still defensively. To me, you have to start right now. Here's the time. There it is. Stop them on defense, not give up the yardage. Use your timeouts in order to get the ball back and try and score. Oh, did they not give him a TFL there? They might not have. And keep in mind, it'll also stop the clock at the two-minute warning. On third down, Allen. And he's got his favorite target yet again. It's complete. I don't know if they gave him the TFL on that one. It's fourth down. Just two minutes remaining here in the fourth quarter of what has been a... It said one plus sack TFL. So it's Bill's football here as we get you reset. And let's see what they've come up with offensively after having time to talk it over. They only punted twice in the win last week as he gets this one away. Here we go, here we go. All right, let's see. Let's see if we get the ball back or not. All right. Come on. Special teams did their job, putting this offense back inside the 10. Now how can the defense respond? Here's the Buffalo offense now as they get set to take over here. And we got to call our timeouts to just so we can make sure we... Potentially get a TFL. going to use the second of their timeouts as they'll talk things over prior to this upcoming second down play. Allen going to leave it on the draw for McCoy. And that didn't fool anybody. He's going to be tossed right, to the back. That's our last chance right here. Now the Bengals going to signal for their third and final it's timeout pick. as they'll head to the sideline and talk over what to do next. On third down, here's McCoy. I don't know if he's gonna get it. I don't know if they're gonna count that one tackle as a TFL or not. I thought it was, but it's a gain of five, but it'll lead to a We actually ended up making it respectable in the end. when you wanted to close your eyes because of all the points. Let's see. Yeah, I don't think they gave it to him. Which is fine. He 